Hello everyone. Today I will be picking this Dom Sigma. Um, yeah, Euro cylinder. Um, it's a six pin lock with some passive pins on the side. You can see here also on the other side. They are not really important for picking. So this has a nice step like fitting. Never noticed before just now. And the keyway is a, a topic on its own. It's really nice. Like they put the logo and the name in the keyway, like D O M. I don't know if you can see it with the contrast. I hope so. But it's not really closed. So, yeah. You can get a peek through there. But I mostly pick from the sledge here, from the M. But you can use a more or less thick pick and tensioner, like in 0.6 millimeters and uh, SP13 tensioner. I don't know what is it is in millimeters. SP13 like the zero from multi pick. So again, key works fine. Get the tensioner in. Maybe zoom in a bit. Tensioner in here. It's a bit sloppy because this M this D is so wide, right? So yeah. Let's just start with something thick. And 0 0.6 millimeters. And then I can also have a few set can use or something thinner so I can feel the pin states a bit better. Got core movement there. Let's try a steeper, thinner hook in 0.4 millimeters. Nice deep full set now. Let's find the spool. Spools. Still needs to be set. <coughs> Sorry there. This one looks promising. Maybe I didn't drop that much. With this lock I dropped so many pins when setting up spools usually. So, not so nice to the spool. Hmm. Can't feel it, can't find it.
off it. Well, I think I've said it, but I lost some other pins. So yeah, it's turned 180. So I can use a pink shoe. Uh, maybe it would be wise to get rid of the C clip while it's still in the vise. Let's try that. I really like the dome locks, but the C clips really painful. Sorry, sorry. Finally. Yeah, once you have a gap, it has lost. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> okay. now but also the pins on the side and something stuck okay let's put this one here Put it here and first remove the driver pins. Okay. 
I'm trying to do the pinning tray. So, this is what number six looks like. I, I should get the springs because otherwise, they will just end up not getting torn. Well, they are all the same, I guess, but still. Oh, I just noticed my front follower wasn't deep enough in. So I missed pin six, actually, and this was five. So now we're completely in. And this is pin six which is identical to pin 5. And again we get the spring. The springs are really strong when shooting out the drivers. I think they're steel springs. Ah, oh, sorry, I got two as one. Uh, do you see? And then two is the spool. This one. And three is again one of these barrels, or whatever you call them, springs. And just one left. Again, one of these barrels. I'll give you a close up of the pins in the end. Um, yep, that's it to car, uh, to housing. Let's have a look at the core. Don't know what's best to arrange the springs quickly. to take it out because then the side pins are but let's just do it one after another. Oh yeah, there are side pins. Sorry, this takes ages. Where did this one go? All right, here. Yeah. yeah, just push them out one by one. Now this one's a torpedo. 
some overset trap. I guess I use it mostly on the longer key pins. Again, five also torpedo and six as well. And then you see here the the side pins or the passive pins. Yeah, it's best to get them out now. Or like this, right? Oh, I can't get them with my hands. So they are in one, two, and four. Let's try to. Yeah. Oh, Lord. And then on the other side. They are in the last positions. Let's try to get them out as well. Won't move at all. Damn it. No. On the table. <laughs> this is ridiculously hard on camera. Why? Okay. Here you go. They're all the same. Oh yeah, forgot. Of course you see um, the grooves here and here where they are sitting in. And if you don't insert the right key, then it won't turn. So here are the pins. All steel springs and I think also steel key pins, right? Steel pins. Yeah, these barrel pins are really nice. Yep, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Oh, what a long video. Sorry for that, but it is how it is. <laughs> so, stay safe. Bye.